Hey there, history buffs. Today I'm diving into a dark chapter of British history that's been hidden for far too long. Ever heard of Operation Legacy? If not, buckle up. Back in the 1950s, as the British Empire was crumbling, the UK government came up with a secret plan to cover its tracks. This plan, known as Operation Legacy, involved removing or outright destroying sensitive documents from colonies before they gained independence. The goal, protect Britain from embarrassment by hiding evidence of colonial violence and human rights abuses. Operation Legacy was like a cloak of invisibility spread across the Caribbean, Asia and Africa. One of the most infamous cases was in Kenya. During Kenya's state of emergency from 1952 to 1960, the British colonial government used brutal tactics mass imprisonments, torture and executions. Historians later uncovered hidden documents that laid bare these atrocities, shocking the world. But Kenya wasn't alone. Similar cover-ups took place in British Guyana, now known as Guyana, and other colonies. The British government wanted to sanitize their colonial history, ensuring they could maintain economic ties with former colonies without facing backlash. By concealing the true extent of their actions, they aimed to keep their global image squeaky clean. And the legacy of British colonialism doesn't end there. It continues to shape our world today. Take the Israel-Palestine conflict, for example. The Balfour Declaration of 1917, which supported a Jewish homeland in Palestine, was a strategic move by Britain to gain American support during World War I. British colonialism wasn't just about military invasions. It also involved legal and administrative control, such as the use of indirect rule in Africa, where local leaders were co-opted into enforcing colonial policies. This allowed Britain to maintain control while minimizing direct military intervention. Even today, former colonies are grappling with the consequences of their colonial past. King Charles III's recent visit to Kenya, marking the country's 60th independence anniversary, is a testament to this ongoing struggle. His acknowledgement of the painful colonial history, including the Mau Mau uprising, signifies a step toward reconciliation and understanding. So next time you think about the British Empire, remember Operation Legacy and the hidden crimes it sought to bury. History isn't just about what's remembered. Sometimes it's about what's deliberately forgotten. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for more deep dives into hidden histories. Catch you next time.